day two. You having a good time? Oh, well, great time. Well, the morning was super interesting. Four different store stops, maybe even five. And the big one was 45 minutes to get tire chains because in order to get our permit, we had to have tire chains. Right. And it's probably a good idea. So anyways, man, the sun is out. The red rocks are covered in white. We are finally on our way out of town. You ready to do this? Let's do it. Let's do it. Before we go into the National Park, we're looking the mighty Colorado down below. Unbelievable. Sun's trying to shine on us, how kind of it. But the terrain just goes on and on and on forever. It's just huge, big terrain. Hopefully he's trying to collect some prickly pear to cook up for dinner. He's gonna saute it. Uh, yeah, this is about the last zone you can fly the drone in. Once we get inside the National Park, there's a, it's a no drone zone. So we want to take an opportunity to capture some shots over there. This is freaking sweet, dude. Dude, it is super sweet. It's not crazy real. technical. It's not technical at all. Dead Horse Point right up top there. I think it's about to get a little bit technical here. Those are tough throwing rocks down, as much we might was. Oh, wow. wow. Freaking river down there. That is just... This is like that uh, road in Peru, like that Death Mountain Road, mm -hmm. <laughs> where if you go a little too far to the left, it's nice knowing you.
Schaefer switchbacks. It's a good thing we came through the potash and didn't try to drop down that because uh, it's closed. Man, that's majorly on my hit list for sure. And uh, been meaning to bring the motorcycle down there as well. <laughs> Levi's getting restless. Onward to the white rim. To be continued. nice up till now for the weather so far today but that right there is a definite downpour of snow about five, 400 feet down. We're drawing near our camp, getting closer to it. Within probably six, seven miles of it right now. It's here, huh? Mm-hmm. Careful, don't die. Don't get dead. Around every freaking corner is more epic than the last. Wow, look at that shit, dude. Whoa. Did they just forecast up to 12 inches of snow here? Mostly cloudy until midnight, then becoming partly cloudy. Lows 10 to 20. Arches National Park. It's just about sunset here and we're rolling into our camp pretty close it's right kind of on the ledge what 39 degrees add a little breeze for the wind chill and it's pretty cold it's been a freaking epic day huh levi all things considered it's been a pretty productive day pretty enjoyable day yes. and i'm just looking forward to a nice steak dinner on the wood burning stove there's no fires permitted in here no drones and no fires permitted, but we are gonna use our little containment stove. And uh, it's gonna be quite grand, so stay tuned. All right, people, we're finally doing it. Finally camping in a snowstorm. It's awesome. Who knows, man? Might wake up to two feet of snow out here. I think it was forecasting for like just a few inches, but tent, chimney keeper upper. 
device, but uh, that's so that as the snow kind of melts on there or collects on there, it doesn't just pool and pour into the tent. Ooh, are we getting ready to make some dinner? Oh, so get this oil to start. That'll warm up. Mm-mm, the usual. I should have grabbed my chair and I should have grabbed my solar panel. But you could have grabbed your charger though too, right? 